Why, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Voice of the Rings. I am your hosting guide, Zolan Iron Shield. And today, I'm going to do... This will be a little bit of a bigger video guide here for Rise to War, but I'm going to put the respect on a few of my commanders, and we're going to ascend one or two commanders today. What is ascending, you might ask? Well, I'm going to explain that as we go right now. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Welcome if you like Lord of the Rings content. So now, and this is Rise to War, my Rise to War playlist on the channel. We do lots of Lord of the Rings here on this channel. Many different games, many different more things and stuff, and replica reviews, things like that. But uh, right now, what we're going to do is we are going to cover, uh, in a previous video, I went through and I used the respect thing, which is now gone here. I literally used all 15 of them. Versus, and then in another video, we will do the item conversions and stuff, decide what items I'm going to keep and convert and things like that. Um, I'm kind of thinking when it comes to items, I'm going to probably have to just convert all of them if I'm, because competitively, I think they're more powerful, but I'm going to have to decide as I go. Um, so right now in this video is I want to, we are going to ascend wallet. So ascending in the game now. All the commanders, there's still three layers, levels. Blue commanders are mighty commanders, and then purple are epic commanders, gold commanders are legendary. The same ones still start that, but you can technically bring a mighty commander, which is like Dwalin here, who was a blue commander, up to purple and then up to gold. So he automatically was already purple because I had so much respect in him previously before the 2.0 huge expansion and update. But now that you can ascend commander, since they did it automatically, I am going to do another ascension here to that. Funny thing is he needs Dane's coins to get, I need 40 of them. And the cool part is, and 150 of his other one. The best part is I used all of my respect to pull out the commanders I'm not gonna use in the next few seasons. So I now have a bunch of these ones I can choose what I want out of, uh, let's see, where are they? There they are. So I want to choose, I need several, oh uh, gosh, I already forgot the number. How many do we need to ascend him here? We need, okay, 21, 21 coins. So we go in here and we're gonna go get 21 of these out of my ones I pulled out of other commanders and I want Dane coins. 21 Dane coins, receive. Boop. So this is, I basically pulled this respect out of other commanders to do this. And now we're gonna go into here, ascend. And again, I already have the 150 pipe weed I need. It's gonna go ahead and send him. Let's see the animation. I'm gonna go away here so we can watch it. Here we go, ascent. Dude, that is awesome animation. I like it. All right, so now my Dwalin is a gold commander, which is awesome. All right, very, very awesome indeed. I'd like to point out that my, um, they are my team. They are one of my teams. Dane, Gimli, Dwalin, and Thorin. And then my other team is Falgan, Balin, Ori, and Legolas. And then I've got some other teams built up too. I'm going to have a horse team. And then um, I'm going to try to also have a um, an elf team. And I've got an evil team too. I'm going to try to have this top one. Uh, I could technically have two evil teams, but I'm just going to stick to one today. So there we go. You saw that. So now I need to see other respect. Think, see where I want to go. I'd like to also ascend Falgan right now. So I only need, oh, actually I need quite a bit of gold to ascend Falgan. Um, I need a debate on if I want to do that or not. Um, and my relics. But I'll keep the relics for another video. Like I said with the, with the items video, because it's going to get way too much in, in these videos otherwise. There's a lot to do <laughs> uh, with this update. There's a lot. So again, uh, respect. I'm not gonna worry about uh, their respect's already really high. Um, let's see. And then these are getting closer. So how high can I get his respect? So again, I could possibly throw points into Balin and get him higher and higher, but I'm not gonna worry about ascending them right now. Um, I'd almost rather put the points into Gimli but as you can see, it takes a lot more points once you're at this high respect. I can hold it down and see what does 86 of these get us. Gets us to about almost halfway. So it's really, really hard. Again, they've kind of scrunched it. So I think, I don't know what the, I don't remember what the level cap is right now with commanders. In fact, I might be able to find that out for you guys right now. Let me see here. Not that one, wrong button. Nope, not that one. What happened to their information thing? Uh, I wonder if they remove that for now and while well, they're doing the update. They usually have the information of other people's stuff, but that's okay for now. Let's go ahead and do the ascension here on Falgin. 
So I need to go into the items again, and he only had 13, so that means he needs to have... Uh, he needed, like, let's just go ahead and get this for now. Um, we need fragments of Thorin's map. Again, they need to update it where that these items tell you that, because right now this says it only does respect for Thorin, but I kind of wish it would say, and also ascends Falga, right? In the, like, in, it, it should say that, so. Let's go ahead and take that. It's a little glitchy when I do this, I will say. Kind of weird how glitchy it is. Um, that was not enough maps. I need a little bit more, I think, to ascend him. I just want to double check. Five more, okay? Wrong button. So I need five more golds. I'm actually using these up real quick. That is okay, though. Because these are... Everything goes to my dwarves. My dwarves get it all. Anything left over goes to everybody else. <laughs> All right, there we go. Perfect. So now that we have that, and technically I have a lot more I can use for Falgan as well for respect, but um, we can now ascend Falgan since he was already high. All right, here we go. Great sound effects. That's a cool sound effect. All right, so increases uh, risk level cap. Level cap is 20 now. There we go. Okay, so they've, they squished it from being respect uh, level 25 is max to respect level 20 and they did the ascendance at 5 10 or no uh yeah 5 and 10 so if you're a blue commander if you get to level 5 you can go to purple level commander and at level you know 10 you can go to level 20 commander kind of thing all right so now that we have that so technically i could give him more experience with these respect items that i have which i could definitely do here see i could i could pump it up um it definitely once you get to 10 it starts really costing the experience which makes sense because it's probably like in reality probably like level 18 respect or something in the previous was 25 was the max so it's going to take a little bit more work and stuff to get higher up as you go in the game but you know what? why don't i just gift him it because he's the only one that's going to be using it so there you go falcon have some more of your beard beads i guess he calls them <laughs> So, uh, oh, they gave us a whole other three points. Fantastic. So we'll drop another one, Erdlewin Explorers. Now he can have two fully maxed and a couple extra points in Bloodline there. Cool. All right, awesome. So we got Falcon kind of set up there. That's really, really cool. Um, and then pretty much what I'm going to want to aim to do here, I could also send Theoden and Imrahil. So, yeah, I could have sent Theoden if I wanted to. Oh, wow, I need a lot for him, though. He he needs Gandalf the White, interesting enough. Um, respect. I'm glad I didn't get rid of all those. I did not realize in the previous video. Um, I've got Imrahil. They're going to be leading my horse squad. That'll be kind of fun. Uh, so now, at this point... Man, I've got... I've got I'm kind of set up here with my teams. Um, the next one I'm going to be doing is really, like, setting up items like redoing the items and pulling out all the items of my commanders. That'll be another video. So I want to just kind of basically talk about respect increases and ascension for this one and kind of show you how it looks like and how to do it. Um, and again, those are the items you're going to need. It'll be different for every character you come in here and click. So again, whatever you have, whichever you have ascended, almost ascended, you'll have to check. But so yeah, Gandalf the... There we go. I've got, see, a couple of these are all, these are all respect two and three now because I took some out of their characters because they weren't really my main characters. Respect three, respect seven. I kept Gandalf the Grey because he's kind of awesome. I ended up not using Galat, Arwen, Elro here. Faramir, I, I just left him respect five. He could technically be ascended right now, see, because he's respect five. So he would just, <laughs> whoops. Actually got rid of the 10 mushrooms from Frodo and Sam. But you know what? I don't know. I think I might ascend Faramir for fun. So, because I have the respect items for that. It's only, there's only 10. So I go in here. I can select custom items. Oh, interesting. Well, I'll just take, it's not the right one. I'll just take the Falcon ones though. If you go into here, I need 10. I've got 372 of these now because I pulled out a bunch in that previous episode. You can go see why if you want to go watch that. But, um... I have plenty of stuff here. Lots for Gimli if I wanted to, lots for whoever. Kind of have to decide. Okay, so now that we have that, let's go ahead and, for fun, ascend Theramir. From being a mighty commander to an epic commander. Since he's respect five, he can go up. So I'm going to go ahead and have fun with this. Enjoy, Theramir, captain of Gondor. 
your new quality. Haha, <laughs> see what I did there? You guys are like, come on, Zola. <laughs> so again, a gold commander could always get to respect 20, even without ascending. Purple and blues have to ascend now at five for purple for blues, and at purples yeah! they have to send a ten. All right, wow, that's very loud, Mr. Aragorn. In a second, he's like, "We're fighting. It's a war." Yeah. So anyway, very cool. I'm actually kind of wondering, like, where did uh, what happened to my other hobbits? They're taking the hobbits to Isengard. I don't have this one yet. Is it because I have no respect in these that I just can't even like see my Hobbit friends? I'm a little confused why, do I have a filter on? Wait, wait, maybe I have a filter on, hold on. No, I don't. Let's see, Hobbit commanders. Oh no, they're there. I was just missed them because they're purple. <laughs> so my only blue commanders in the good side right now are Merry and Pippin pretty much and Boromir at this point. <laughs> They're the ones I weren't really wasn't really using too much, even though they are good commanders. Poor Frodo and Sam, they're not really very good commanders. Maybe they are now. What do they do now? Maybe they're better now with the update. Damage received by commander's formation. Oh, that's good. But it's damage dealt. What? Reduces damage dealt. Re okay. That seems really not very good. Initiative during combat, army march speed, initiative. That seems pretty good, that one. I don't know why you would use Master of Bagan. That, that seems really bad. There's gotta be a reason, but that seems really bad. Uh, Hobbit Adventurer, Men Elves United, two formations. Affects four formations. I mean, that's pretty strong. That's a pretty strong one. All four formations get 10% increased HP, and that's pretty good. Ring Bearer. Invasion. Yeah, they just, they're just not very good. I don't know. Poor Frodo and Sam are just not very good commanders in this. But um, anyway, I will see you guys in the next episodes of Voice of the Rings. I feel like they should be much better. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks to my Patreons for their support. Subscribe button's there. Next episode will be up there in the top left. And over there is a Lotro tale where I do Lord of the Rings voiceovers and stuff in Lotro. Have a great day. Stay happy, my friends. And hopefully this helped you out a little bit. I'll see you in the next one.